Let go, Jake. But these guys, I feel like they really, they're what's kept her here this long. I don't think she would have still been here if it wouldn't have been for the guys over the years. Like she has really, they gave her something to look forward to. She's our, she's our, she's our super fan. Uh, you see people everywhere with super fans. They got the paint on them and they got all that stuff. And ours is, ours means just as much, if not more. Um, she comes here with, with her own problems that she's got, um, but that does not stop her. She's the happiest kid in the world when she's here at this ballpark, and we try to make it. We try to keep it that way. She really just embodies that there's more to life than baseball, um, and there's always more important things, no matter how bad your day was at the plate or on the mound or whatever you're going through in the classroom, on and off the field, that um, it's always important to, to live every day like it's your last and, and appreciate what you have because no matter what Gabby's going through, no matter what their family's going through, she's always going to come here every single day and she's going to give us all the cheers and give us her best effort to cheer us on. I constantly look at the calendar on my phone. Like every day it's like calendar, calendar. Or she'll take my phone and look it up. What day do we go see the boys? It's always a countdown, and some days it's like 20 times a day. Honestly, I just try to put on a show for her. Uh, we all, we all like to see her smile and like to see her see her happy, especially after the games when we win. She's, she's over there smiling, screaming for all of us to come say hi and stuff and stuff like that. So, it's it's really nice to see her find happiness through us and us winning. It's. It's something that makes me happy, and I know it makes a bunch of the other guys happy too. One of the funny things is this year, the amount of opposing players that come up to me and, and ask if this is Gabby's first year coming here, because I swear she saved all her cheers and all her, and all her energy for this year. Um, she is louder and more vocal and more supportive than ever before, and you can really just see how much she gets into the game. This group, like they just seem like they love her so much. They're always willing to. Take time, give her fist bumps, high fives, hugs. Like she, she really loves the hugs. We just really, really appreciate all the love that we get here from everybody, from the coaches, the players, the parents. That love kept going all the way to the NCAA tournament as the team took Gabby and her family to the Knoxville Regional. I mean, it's been the most amazing experience ever. I'm just at a loss of words really for it. I mean, just the whole experience, like we've never, you know, got to travel with the team. It's just like a giant family and everyone has treated us that way from the very beginning. Well, they always have, but this year just especially. And then with this trip, you know, just going with the team and it was just like we were a part of it and it's really helped. It's really helped her. She was cheering as loud as she could. Like she was really, she was into it and rocking back and forth. She had, um, she had her pom poms that somebody gave her and a little megaphone, and she had like a little towel she would wave. And she was just so excited, smiling the whole time. Like, she, I don't think her smile ever left. Gabby's smile was spreading smiles in Knoxville and beyond as the spotlight was put on her story and the team worked to get her here and they've done fundraisers in the past for her and her family and she is riding in style and has brought a smile to so many faces in that Campbell dugout in that program and in the surrounding community we were totally not expecting ESPN to be showing us I had people sending me messages like oh we just seen her on TV so that was pretty cool to be like just everyone I guess there's no telling how many people saw us. So it was really nice and, you know, just getting Gabby's story out. For that to get put on ESPN and, and for that to get some some national spotlight, I think says a lot about um, says a lot about our guys and how much they they care about the people that, that want to be a part of our program, but certainly says a lot about our institution and and you know that that we want people to, to love being around us, and, and we want to invest in those people. Others started to invest also, as baseball fans from around the nation gave to Gabby. Just really special to see other people rally around who we know to be somebody that's very special, and then be able to, to kind of introduce her to the community around us was really special to, to see those people rally as well. We really got a lot of donations. I think we got around like $4,000, I think, got donated from the stories because like it hadn't been in the light we hadn't really shared it until the stories started coming out and then like everyone just started sharing it and was sending messages on there and just donating 
that was we really appreciate that and that's really helped a lot already you know we've been able to use some of it and it's helping make life easier just amazing to just see the outreach from everyone from all over there's special people everywhere you turn to and and gabby is example number one of of seeing somebody that that um, man makes the most of every single day and um, it's really hard to take a day for granted when she's around